CL2020, the last time this examination occurred, it was 2017. Luckily, I was also sitting for the same examination. I still remember the date, 26th March 2017. I did not qualify that examination. The cutoff was super high. It was 175 out of 200 marks. I got only 164 marks but I, i'm having an experience with this examination and since all of you guys started to comment in the comment section that please make a strategy video for cil examination i decided to give it a look when i looked at the syllabus and i looked at the pattern i looked at what is the whole system of this examination i found out that it is exactly the same as it was in 2017. so i decided to share my experience because i might be able to explain a lot of things that you might be uh, experiencing during the examination so basically the system is very simple it is a three hours examination divided into two part paper one and paper two paper one is divided again into four parts number one current affairs or general awareness two aptitude and three is reasoning basically two and three full combines to be giving you 50 marks question which is basically aptitude what you prepare for gate examination and the fourth part will be general english so this is basically composed of 100 questions out of which 25 is general awareness and 50 is basically aptitude and reasoning and the last 25 is english so basically 75 marks is same as gate examination Paper 2 will be 100% technical, whatever your stream is, questions will be coming from that. From my experience and what you can still see in CIL 2017, the questions are super easy. I can at least talk about mechanical engineering. It does not mean that the examination was very easy in 2017. That means it has to be same in 2020. You cannot be sure about anything. But yes, looking at the probability, it says that yes, examination is pretty easy. That does not mean that the competition is going to get easy. The cutoff is going to rise. And last year you saw that there were only 25 marks in mechanical engineering to be spared as margin. That is very high for any competitive examination for a government job. Anyways, this is the pattern. No calculator is allowed and you won't even need calculator because out of 100 questions in technical, each consisting of one marks by the way, around four or five will be utilizing your brain otherwise most of the question will be whatever you know you put it over there so calculator will not be needed or will not be provided plus uh, the negative marks there's no negative marks over here and that is another big reason for the cutoff going very high right so be uh, be sure that you will be answering all the 200 questions out of the 200 questions provided even if you mark it uh, just by like whatever your guess is it might be correct okay now coming to what should be your strategy see the examination is going to happen in the last week of february that is almost a month after the gate examination that is good that it is not going to hinder with gate examination the thing with cil examination is the pattern is so simple or the questions type of questions are so simple you do not need much extra preparation if you are asking me how should i prepare for this examination if i have to prepare then I would say that general awareness, I do not know myself how to prepare that general awareness video for engineering services also I made by the help of God of Joshi. But yes, if you are prepared for general awareness for some other examination, then you should revise that for this one. Aptitude and general, uh, sorry, uh, reasoning and aptitude, both you should be following whatever I said in the aptitude and English video and English also it is explained very well. In that video you will get some idea right so this 50 marks of reasoning and aptitude is a good place where you can put some practice if you want to be certain about those 50 marks try to get 50 out of 50 right english is a thing that very few people know how to study i do not know that how to study english because it is a vast infinite place where from where you can study so basically my advice to most of the aspirant always has been that you should download those apps about which i have also talked in this video and uh, you should learn more and more new words that might be useful every now and then technical you should be very strong and you should you can look at some state level or sscj technical questions and only those level of questions the level of questions will be even lower than engineering services okay so if you're serious with this examination you can prepare from these places but you can prepare after gate examination don't worry about it even if you're serious about this examination but one more thing you are not taking care of is that BARC examination is going to be somewhere at the last week of March as it has happened every year. This, might, this year it might change but most likely you are again going to get 20 to 30 more days for BARC written test. So you can plan it accordingly. Okay, These days GATE is not the only examination that is important. 
so till now i've discussed about the pattern i think that everything is clear if something if you are having a doubt please comment it down below and uh, how to study there's no special strategy for this examination the examination happens to be very easy and if you're prepared for gate examination you're prepared for isro examination and even engineering services then you will be good to go just maintain that practice and in the last one or two weeks revise your micro notes a lot because some of the questions will be mug up type questions you cannot afford to make here any mistakes right so those are the things that you can do eligibility criteria and all that the link will be down in the description box i urge you guys to just go through the pdf that cil is providing you will get some valuable information out of that if you are preparing for this examination i think that you can at least go through the pdf if you are serious with this examination right and uh, the links of previous year questions will be down in the description box that is the easiest website i found where you can just click on the link and you will get the pdf of the previous year question bank and uh, going through the previous year question paper is also very very important just watching this video will not help you so you can do that other than that a little bit about the job itself there's a bond amount and bond amount is for valid for five years and it is costing somewhere around i think three lakh rupees and uh, some of you guys might be thinking okay it is around 10 lakh package i'll be able to easily save around five lakh rupees and i'll pay the bond and move if you are planning of getting in and getting out understand that in one year you will be able to save somewhere around one lakh rupees ask any person who is working in any psu or a central government having a central government job they'll say the same that maximum one lakh if you are living an okay okay life right so you can think about in that direction this examination is definitely a very good opportunity there is no doubt in that the number of seats are also very high it is 93 general for uh, mechanical engineers it is very high okay one job if it is offering that many seats it is a good place to be that is 2020 is turning out to be a good year isro is also giving so many seats so definitely fill the form definitely appear for the form uh, for the examination but whether how serious you are you can decide that i have given you every information that i was aware of if you have any more questions you can obviously comment it down below and i'll be happy to answer you guys and uh, that's about it i hope that you got some valuable information out of it without any waste of your time and uh, i'll be seeing all of you in the next one till then bye if you want to improve your spoken english if you want to improve your personality then definitely you can check my second youtube channel the link will be down in the description box it is on personality development i'll see all of you in the next one till then bye